dear parishioners and friends. Uh, I am sending out this uh, weekly update at the beginning of the month of May, a month that's traditionally dedicated to Mary. Pope Francis has recently sent out a letter to Catholics throughout the world, inviting us and encouraging us to pray the rosary during this month. And so we have created a rosary video on our website. Each decade of the glorious mysteries is led by a family from within our parish. It will be a way for you to pray the rosary this month, along with fellow parishioners in your home. This fourth Sunday of Easter is also the World Day of Prayer for Vocations. So instead of our usual Sunday homily posted on the website, I have asked our seminarian, Carlos, to provide a reflection for this Sunday focused on his vocation. Carlos has been with us this past year doing his pastoral year from the seminary. Uh, Carlos is uh, staying at home with his family during this lockdown, but has continued to serve the parish by calling parishioners from our database from home. This past Wednesday was the Feast of St. Catherine of Siena, the patroness of our parish. Father Philippe, Deacon Tom, and myself celebrated the feast day mass together, and we prayed for all of you uh, parishioners. I'm also glad to announce that there's been published a new book about St. Catherine of Siena. It is written by Father Paul Murray, a Dominican priest who teaches in Rome. Uh, information about the book is found on our website. Finally, we are initiating a pandemic art experience project within the parish. People of all ages are invited to create works of art that express your experience during this COVID uh, pandemic lockdown. It could include poems, prayers, uh, drawings, paintings, uh, photos, whatever. The plan will be to gather these as an historical record of what we were going through during this time. Also, uh, when we are out of this, we will plan for some sort of prayer service of thanksgiving, and we will have a display of this artwork that you create. Uh, we maybe have this display also in our schools. Let me know if you have created or will create uh, something for this project. I will fin finish today with one of the Marian prayers that was provided by Pope Francis for this month of May. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. We fly to your protection, O Holy Mother of God. Do not despise our petitions in our necessities, but deliver us always from every danger. O glorious and blessed Virgin, 